going on everybody today i got all of my equipment uh for my qls uh holster i'm gonna be doing so this is a uh, safari land mid-ride paddle and attached to it is the qls system which it's like quick what or is it qrs quick release system qr i think it's quick lock i don't know qls qrs one of the two so basically it's a two-part this main backing you bolt to the paddle and the holster would be attached to this part and as you just saw i could you know unbuckle it so the holster would actually be mounted to this that way you could just slide in your holster lock it in boom and if you have to you can uh you can switch out to a different pistol just unbuckle it just like your standard buckle slide it off put your new one on and boom and uh, attached to it i have the uh t-rex arms uh thigh strap uh all of it's obviously in tan because i run a multi-cam kit this is for my uh my my kit i'm going to sadly i think i have to get another uh different battle belt because i have a molly uh, i think it's a three or four uh three or four inch molly uh battle belt and sadly it won't i can't attach it in any way so i'm gonna have to get a thinner probably two inch uh molly battle belt one that i could actually feed through my belt loops which is what i really want and uh we'll be able to insert uh you know put this on there uh, I mean, I could just have this on my belt, my actual belt at all times, and then put the battle belt over it. But at the same time, you know, I don't know. I haven't experimented with it. So now I'm going to attempt to make, attempt, I'm going to make it. I'm going to make a holster for my M17 because that is my Milsim pistol. And uh, for now... Uh, because my Glock kind of uh, took an oopsie, something one of the uh, one of the O-rings, and it's kind of fucked up. So uh, it won't when you chamber a BB, it will literally just fall out of the barrel. So I have to uh, I have to fix that. But yeah, so this is the new new holster setup. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be selling holsters uh, like this. Otherwise, they'd be uh, pretty expensive. You know, uh, just all this alone's like fifty bucks. So, um, and then of course the holster tacked onto it. So, I mean, they'd be close to about a hundred bucks. I mean, but it, I, I, I mean, that could be a thing. I could sell it at one point. So, uh, I don't know. I mean, I don't, I don't know if uh, Safari Land could sue me for selling their products as a, uh, unlicensed distributor, but, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. It is, uh, I mean, I could always make it where they are compatible that you could just bolt these right onto the QSL or QR, whatever the fuck this system is. That way you could just mount it straight to that, you know, buy your own hardware and boom, just throw it on your mount. So I'm excited about this because it's going to make my kit look that much better, uh, in my opinion, and more uh, versatile. I could just, uh, I could always just change on the fly. So I just have to have a different holster for a different pistol with one of these on it and just clip her on. So. Anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna get to it. I'm gonna also make a sheath. I'll probably do that first, honestly. Maybe not. Uh, I need to make a sheath for my training knife because the Milsim is coming up, and we are allowed to use these. And I would definitely like to have this as a uh, backup of any, you know anything. You know, at least I'm able to fight in the Milsim. You know, at least able to eliminate players. There you go. So, because I uh, can't really do that with uh, your hand, you know, can't knife hand somebody. So, anyways, um, the video is live on FPT. Go check it out. It's uh, it's 40 minutes long. Um, and, uh, yeah, it went live at, uh, like, 1 o'clock today. So, go check that out for me. You know, uh, like I said, it is 40 minutes long. But, um, you know... If uh, you ain't doing anything for half hour, check it out. Appreciate it. And uh, show me some love. You know, got a couple likes already. So appreciate that.
Uh, but yeah, that's uh, it's probably gonna do some Kydex work. Tattoo's healing up pretty uh, pretty good. Um, haven't had any issues with it. And uh, yeah, tomorrow I get to switch to lotion because uh, I hate putting on Aquaphor. Putting on Aquaphor. I don't know why that came out so fucked up, but uh, yeah, I hate I hate it. It's, uh, I hate the greasy feeling. Even though that's uh, that's what my tattoo artist has told me for years and years and years. So you know, if anything, put Aquaphor on it. Otherwise, use specific tattoo, like tattoo goo. I used to use that a lot, too. So, uh, yeah, anyways, I'm going to get to work. Making some uh, good old tor 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 tortellinis. Got the good old four cheese, four cheese, tort, good old torts. So, he was about to be home here in just a couple minutes, and I uh, figured... Make for some dinner. Yeah, it's four cheese. Yeah, she lactose intolerant. She giving it the good fuck you. I'm eating it anyways. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna have some tortellini. It's, uh, gotta add some, gotta add some, gotta add some stuff to it. And there it is. Good old fucking four cheese plus four cheese plus three cheese tortellini. She's got the, the four plus four. Is it, is it good? Mm -hmm. Is it poop? Poop later. Oh, you're gonna poop later, but yeah. Even yeah. <laughs> so, uh, just salt, pepper on top, mm. and uh, yeah, I decided to melt some uh, melt some cheese on mine, y'all. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. That's some good shit right there, boy. And then uh, we're gonna run out to Chase's, and I gotta go get his Glock and uh, make a holster. So. As I'm making one for myself. You shut up. You get none of this. Okay, so we just ate all our dinner. That was some good ass torta. There's some beers in it. Hold on it. What y'all crackheads doing? What y'all doing? What are you doing? Anyways, as I was sitting there uh, trying to get the deer to get in my car, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, we ate our dinner. It was pretty goddamn good. Uh, I definitely want to do it again with the uh, the melted cheese on top. That topped it off literally. And uh, yeah, so now I'm on my way to Chase's house. Go pick up. Go pick up his Glock and. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go get that and make a holster for him and head home and uh, you know finish mine up. Probably uh, be able to knock his out tomorrow. Actually, I, I will be able to knock his out tomorrow. So it just be it's almost getting too late in the night to be using machines because they're fucking loud. So, but anyways, let's uh yeah let's go uh, get this go get the cat. Okay, so just uh, picked up Chase's good old Glocky Wonky. So we're gonna um, go ahead and extract the rest of that orange tip out of there. This is a uh, Glock 17. Mine is the 19X. So uh, I have the same lower frame and I just have a shorter uh, slide and barrel length. So uh, just actually mine's a Gen 5 and this is a Gen 4. So anyways, uh, yeah, just picked this up from Chase. Hung out with him for a little bit. He's, uh, He's, uh, you know, he's, uh, he's going some, through some shit. So, but, uh, just took the, I literally just took the M17 out of the press. It's not even, uh, you know, together. So, um, got it masked and everything set for the, you know, I, I talked about this earlier. Huh? It's fucking retarded name. Yeah. So I had to, uh mask out a T style section that way I can mount it to that that's you know just imagine it trimmed up that's gonna be it so tan on tan and uh yeah Actually, I have a good feeling it's gonna draw good so 
That's not a good sign. Oh, wait. Oh, it wasn't on. That's something I always want to avoid. My flashlight turning on. It's kind of weird because it's fully ma it's masked heavily. A lot of spots I had to uh, I had to do. But anyways, guys, that's uh that's oh stop it. It's, it's... Uh yeah, so I got a lot of work. Anyways, yeah, so what was saying? So we just got Chase's Glock. We're gonna make that tomorrow. Finish up my. M17 tomorrow, and that'll be pretty quick. Mount it to that, have the leg strap, well, thigh strap, and get this all done and nice. It'll be a full uh, encasement holster. So it'll be just like this, minus the, it's not gonna be light bearing. So it'll be a little thinner. Uh, I mean, like, this way. <laughs> Anyways, that's it. See you guys tomorrow, bye.